Hello and welcome back to another horror vlog. Today we're reading out of this book, The Return of Christ by Angelus Domini. Today we're going to be reading American Christians Punished First. Okay. That's also, that's page 39. If you would like to know what page to follow along with. It, it reads, as Lord Ralph said, one cannot complain about the behavior of other children unless they are willing to discipline their own. He has also said, an undisciplined child is an unloved child. Rough. I just want to stop for a minute because that is a good point. Knowing how children are today and how unsupervised and how rowdy and spoiled they are these days. That chapter could not be furthest from the truth. So please, discipline your children. Love your children. You are blessed if you have children. Remember that. Continuing on, American Christians have spelt, uh, spread false version of the gospel around the world. A work of Satan made to cause confusion in believers and rejection of the return Messiah. Their blasphemies are greater than we could possibly list here. And they are deserving of chastisement. Let's continue on with this. So, quick side note. Continuing on with the fact that this day and age, it's not just children that are spoiled, by the way. Grown-ups grown can be just as spoiled. Think about this. How many of you are thankful to God for what you have? Hmm? Have you thanked God lately? If your answer is no, on your knees, pray, talk to God. Thank him for everything that you have. And if you don't have something, it's probably a reason. Or, maybe you should just thank God for what you have. But Lord Rail striking America's Christians before others is also a fulfillment of prophecy. First Peter 4:17 For the time has come for judgment to begin and to begin at the house of God. And if it begins with us, what will be the end of those who reject God's good news? I'm glad I did this one today because I've been thinking, myself included, I haven't thanked God enough. And I don't think that there I will ever feel like I do thank God enough for all of the blessings that I have in my life.
we all must be more thankful, myself included. Let's end. I know that this video is running a little long, but let's continue and say a prayer. Dear God, I want to thank you for today. Thank you for the food. Thank you for housing, shelter, for my family, my love, and everything. I don't thank you enough, and I don't think I ever could thank you enough for all of the blessings that I have received and that we all have received. I pray to keep my brothers and my sisters, wherever they may be in the world, safe and guide them. And may God bless everybody in the name of the Lord Ryle. Amen. Thank you for joining us and God bless you once again.